Hey, what's up? Today we're going to learn how to check prime numbers in Python 3. Quick review, uh, a prime number is a number that can only be divided by 1 or itself. So we have 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, etc, etc, 919. I created a function called isPrime, and this is all we need to check whether a number is prime or not. So we can throw a number in here like 7, which we know to be prime, and that'll return true. If I threw in, say, 8, um, that'll return false. So how does this work? Uh, first, we have an if statement to check that the number is greater than 1. That'll filter out any negative numbers, plus 0 and 1. Then we're going to loop over a range of 2 up to num, which is the input number. And then we have an if statement that really is the heart of this function that does the checking. Uh, and I'll explain this in a second. Either it's going to catch here and will return false, or if not, and it makes it all the way through the for loop, uh, then I'll set the result to true. We know it's a prime number and we'll return it as true. So I'll add a print statement in here and this will kind of make things a little bit clearer, right? So uh, we can run this with our input of eight and you see that it only iterates over it once. It only iterates over it on that i is equal to two and then that'll catch here and that'll return false. And basically what we're doing is we're checking if, um, if num is only equal to, can only be divided by one or itself, but we're doing it in sort of a negative way. Uh, so we can do this with seven and you'll see it'll loop over everything. It's trying to see if the remainder is zero is on two, trying to see if there's a remainder is zero on three, trying to see if there's a remainder is zero on four, five, six, et cetera. And it's just not the case, so it never goes into that if statement. Uh, thus, it'll go into the else, setting the result to true. One more I could try to make this clear is using nine. Uh, it'll pass the two, so it won't catch on the two, but it will catch on the three because, of course, nine can be divided by three, and that'll have a remainder of zero. So that's catching there, and that's why that's false. And what's that, what's that big number I, I mentioned earlier, 919? Um, we'll try to run this without breaking my damn computer. So we run this, you see it's looping over literally everything, um, and it's never catching on that if statement. Um, and so that returns true. So that's pretty much it. We don't need to make things more complicated than it has to be. We just want to check if a number is only divisible by one or itself. And if so, it's prime.